Have you ever found yourself in a situation where you need to check your code for mistakes, but the tools just aren't giving you the clarity you need? If that's you, then you're in the right place. Today, we're diving into how to make Git's add command show changes like the diff command with word differences. I totally get it. You've made a lot of changes to your code and you want to ensure that everything is correct before you commit. It's frustrating when you can't see the specific changes clearly. You're definitely not alone in this struggle. Here's the specific question we're addressing today. One user asked if they could make the command git add-p show changes in the same way that git diff-word diff does. They want to see only the changed words instead of the entire line. Sound familiar? Let's explore this together. So, why is this important? When you replace words in your code, it can be easy to miss false replacements. Having a clear view of what has changed at the word level can save you from potential bugs and headaches down the line. Let's break down how to achieve this. And stick around. At the end of this video, I have a great tip that will enhance your Git experience even further. To achieve the desired output, the user can start by configuring Git to use the word diff option. This will allow the user to see changes at the word level instead of the line level. Next, the user should create a custom diff driver in their Git configuration. This driver will format the output to highlight only the changed words. Now, the user can use the git add command with the patch option. This will allow them to review changes interactively, showing the word level differences. Finally, the user can review the changes before committing. This ensures that any false replacements can be identified and corrected. Fun fact. Did you know that Git was created by Linus Torvalds in 2005? It was designed to handle everything from small to very large projects with speed and efficiency. Just like our coding, Git has evolved to meet our needs. Now, let's look at the answers provided by other users. One alternative approach is to use the interactive.diff filter property available since Git version 2.9. This allows you to customize how diffs are displayed during interactive staging. However, be cautious. Since Git version 2.17, using this command directly with git add p may result in an error message about mismatched output. To avoid this issue, it's safer to use a script for the interactive.diff filter setting. That's all for that response. Let's see what someone else had to say. One alternative solution is to add diff highlight to the interactive.diff filter configuration. This method is simple and works since Git version 2.9. You can do this by running a specific command on Debian or Ubuntu. Here's the tip I promised. Consider creating a Git alias for this command. It can save you time and make your workflow smoother. Just type git config global alias word diff diff word diff to set it up. And there you have it. You now know how to make Git's add command show changes like the diff command with word differences. Remember, customizing your tools can greatly enhance your coding experience. If you found this helpful, hit that subscribe button for more tips and don't miss our next video.